in the next question difference equation of system is given it is also given that system is stable and we have to obtain impulse response of system now by applying that transform on given difference equation y z minus 1 by 2 y z into z inverse plus 1 by 16 uh, y z into z to the power minus 2 will be equal to x of z therefore transfer function h of z which is the ratio of y z upon x z it will be equal to 1 upon 1 minus half z inverse plus 1 by 16 z raised to minus 2 now we can write down in this way 1 upon 1 minus 2 into 1 by 4 z inverse plus 1 by 4 z inverse whole square so h of z will be equal to 1 upon 1 minus 1 by 4 1 upon 1 minus 1 by 4 z inverse whole square now region of convergence is all always related to magnitude of pole if we will calculate pole location then pole will be located at z equals to 1 by 4 now region of convergence for stability of system should be mod z greater than 1 by 4 because in this case region of convergence is outside circle of radius 1 by 4 so it will include unit circle and if roc includes unit circle the nature of system will be stable so in this case system will be stable now nature of roc is outside circle if roc will be outside circle then nature of hn will be right sided so we will write down right sided inverse of h of z now as we know 4z inverse upon 1 by 4z inverse upon 1 minus 1 by 4 z inverse whole square for this term right sided inverse is n into 1 by 4 raised to n u n now if we will replace variable n with n plus 1 then n plus 1 into 1 by 4 ki power n plus 1 into u of n plus 1 if we will uh, replace variable n with new variable n plus 1 then we will multiply z in the transform if we will multiply z in the transform then these two terms will be cancel out now to cancel out this four term we will multiply lhs and rhs with value 4 if we will multiply lhs and rhs of this equation with value 4 then this 4 will be also cancel out and uh, rhs will be equal to 1 upon 1 minus 1 by 4 z inverse whole square which will be equal to h of z and whatever be the inverse of uh, h of z uh, that particular inverse uh, will be equal to h of n therefore h of n will be equal to 4 into n plus 1 into 1 by 4 power n plus 1 into u of n plus 1 now we can write down in this way n plus 1 into 1 by 4 power n into u of n plus 1 now when we will check all four options then option b will satisfy this result so answer will be option b